Hi everyone, in this quick hardware test, I'm going to test this EVGA RTX 3090 in some standard Blender benchmark scenes. And at the end of the video, we will summarize the results compared to everything else that I've tested. So the first scene up, Blender classroom scene. I'm running Blender 3.6 for all of these tests, and I'm running um, cycles with optics. The classroom scene is a relatively fast one. Uh, this one was only about 16 and a half seconds, so I'll log that quick and we'll go on to the next scene. This is the barbershop scene. Uh, again, same situation. I'm running frame 100 on Cycles Optics. And this one is a lot heavier scene, but this clip is sped up. So you'll see it finish here fast, and then uh, we'll throw it on the list. And that one took 67 seconds. So the next scene is the Lone Monk scene. And this one is significantly heavier than the first two scenes. So this takes quite a bit more time. Um, on each of these tests, I would let the rendering start to build the optics database and then uh, stop the render and restart it so that we weren't including that loading time. Uh, this one took 177 seconds. And the last scene is the uh, Blender Scanland scene, which was the uh, Blender 3.3 splash screen, I believe. I show that running here, and then I will log it, and that was 41 and a half seconds. Um, so let's go back to the results now and talk about this card for just a second. So um, on the classroom scene, you can see that the 3090 is um, very fast. It's it's tied with the 4070 and the 7900 XTX. Uh, the 4090 still smashes it, but this is such a small scene, it doesn't really matter. Um, it's too easy to run, so it's definitely error prone. And these are all close enough together to call them even. Uh, for the barbershop scene, um, I'll sort these results here. Uh, the 4090 is on top. Uh, the 3090 is actually about two times slower, which is consistent with the first test. And it just beats out the 7900 XTX in this test. And you can see the other cards there. Uh, most notably, the 4070 is a little bit slower than the 3090. On to the Lone Monk results. Um, this one was really surprising. Uh, the results for the 7900 XTX have been shared with me. I don't own one. Um, but the 4090 ran in, uh, the Lone Monk scene in 97 seconds. The 7900 XTX, 120. And then the 3090 was uh, almost an entire minute slower than the 7900 in the scene which is really, really interesting. Um, and then finally, for the Scanland scene, the 4090 is twice as fast as about everything else. Um, I don't have any high-end AMD results on this list, um, but the 3090 was about two times slower than the 4090, uh, and the 4070 was really close to the 3090. So for all these comparisons, if you'd like to read the list, obviously just pause the video and um, you can see all the data for the other cards. But that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and I hope this is helpful. If you do find it helpful, please subscribe and consider hitting all those magic YouTube buttons for me. Thanks.